An emotional, heartwarming story of a local Marine battling physical and emotional scars from the front lines. Today, he has a new best friend, man's best friend. WISN 12 News Hillary Mintz shows us the special meeting and why it gives this veteran new hope for his own independence. A surgery on my, my, right, my right elbow, my right shoulder. Um, Sergeant Ryan Holliday, a Marine veteran who now lives in Cedarburg, shows us his physical scars from serving in Iraq. What we can't see, his emotional pain after an IED hit his Humvee a couple of years ago. It's a traumatic brain injury, um, so I have a lot of short-term memory loss and then uh, PTSD, depression, and then anxiety. Desperate to heal, he found a program called Guardians of Rescue, where through their Paws of War program, they give veterans service dogs. I've always loved animals, and, I, and, and there's a certain bond between animals and humans that kind of like ease uh, the every you know, everyday stress that you have. For the past six months, Ryan has only seen pictures of a chocolate lab named Jocko that'll soon be his. And this July 4th is the day. It also happens to be this vet's birthday. Jocko, who was flown in from New York Thursday, waits in the car. Then, the moment, the Marine meets his new best friend. With all smiles and heavy panting, it was love at first sight. I'm not going to let this dog go forever. President of the Guardians of Rescue, Robert Masseri, says Jocko is exactly what Ryan needs. Jocko will uh, wake uh, Ryan up early in the morning. We'll get him out of the house. We'll get him out to parks, to you know, big box stores. Uh, get him to places he hasn't been in a long time. Um, today uh, is a day of freedom. Today we feel that Ryan's got it back. Having Jocko as a service dog will help Ryan deal with his PTSD from an emotional standpoint and a social standpoint. And he says, really, just having a companion is something he's looking forward to the most. You doing good? You doing good? A rescue dog once saved, now saving a soldier. In Cedarburg, Hillary Mintz, WISN 12 News. What a great program. The rescue dog program for veterans is only about two years old. Jocko, by the way, makes the 18th service dog to be paired with a vet. And the very first here in Wisconsin.